Hey everyone, welcome to this video. The purpose of this video is to show you how I create a medical illustration using both traditional techniques and combining them with a digital media. I thought this would be useful to show because each artist has their own techniques and styles and uh, they have their own way of working. So I wanted to show you how I combine pencil drawings, traditional painting, along with digital painting. So what I'm going to do now is show you how I do this. I like to sketch all of my projects in pencil first to ensure the work is unique to each client's project. Even though this will be a digital painting, I always use my drawings to start. The drawings are scanned and saved as a JPEG file. This is so I can place the drawing into Photoshop as I need to see the drawing on my computer screen. I use this as my template while I carry out the painting process. The equipment I like to use is called a Wacom tablet and stylus. It is attached to the screen with a cable. My preferred computer is an Apple Mac. The Wacom tablet is used instead of traditional paper pencils and paintbrushes because it allows me as the artist to work directly onto the computer screen. Adobe have created a creative suite of painting tools that has brought desktop publishing software to the home office. The graphic software that I like to use is mainly Adobe Photoshop and Illustrator. The clever people at Adobe have created a pen that will also work as a paintbrush, a pencil, at different widths, in colours. In fact, there is an endless variety of options that I as an artist can use. All artists need a colour palette. With this palette, you have unlimited colours. You can even choose the exact colours to match a client's branding. The completed illustration can now be labelled for a client and then once it's ready it can be sent as a JPEG or a TIFF file for use in a client's print media, for online news, video or animation. Thanks for watching. For more information you can visit my website medical-artist.com.